What's up my people? Welcome back to the channel. Leave a like and also subscribe. Click the tap bell icon to get notified whenever there's anything new on the channel. So the first thing I'm going to share with you know, people, East Kingston police make arresting nursing students murder. The Elliston Road police have arrested and charged a man in connection with the murder of Kimberly Jones. Charge is Nevada Roberts, a construction worker of Victory Street in St. Andrew. Reports are that Jones, a nursing student of Mitchell Street in the parish, was walking along the roadway last Thursday morning when Roberts and another man pounced on her and opened gunfire hitting her to the upper body. She was taken to hospital where she was pronounced dead. Investigations led to the arrest of Roberts where he was subsequently charged with possession of a prohibited weapon and authorized possession of ammunition. His court date is being finalized. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section. I'm going to update upon a man where them find dead in St. Anne. Right? Police identify body of man found in St. Anne. The police have identified the body of a man who was found dead in Liberty Hill, Lime Hall in St. Anne on Friday evening. He is Romario of Clamstead Lime Hall in the parish. Reports from the St. Anne's Bay Police are that about 9.30 p.m. residents heard explosions and summoned them. On arrival of the lawmen, he was seen lying on the steps of an unfinished building with gunshot wounds to the head, shoulder and back. He was taken to hospital where death was confirmed. At least five murders have been reported in St. Anne since the start of the year. Chaja. So people, let me know what you guys think in the comment section. And we are going to move on. Same place in a St. Anne but a different um, community. Man stabbed to death during altercation at home in St. Anne. A Saint Anne man was stabbed to death at his home on Saturday. There is Peter James of Main Street Ocherius in the parish. Reports are that sometime after 7 a.m., James and another man got into an argument when a stone was used to hit the other man to the head, causing a wound. A knife was brought into play and James was reportedly stabbed in the chest. The police were summoned and both men were taken to the hospital where James succumbed to his injuries and the other man treated and released into police custody. The identity of the other man is being withheld pending further investigations. The incident pushed the number of people killed in St. Anne since the start of the year to at least seven. Some residents have expressed concern about the number of killings. One woman said that St. Anne has been in the news too often. Every minute it's another incident. Next killing. St. Anne should be peaceful and it's not right now. Like the people them are trying to break record with the killing. She lamented. So people, they say the next, the, the article before this, them say five person and this killing make seven person get killed from the start of the year Zin half at the number where we at right now in the month you see it so people make me know what you think in the comment section bless up on yourself thanks for watching like comment share and subscribe